All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to Solo Garage. Uh, today we are gonna be reviewing another Chemical Guys product. Um, the box behind me is what we're gonna be unboxing. Um, we're back with uh, Project Adam right now. Uh, we're gonna be trying the product on it. So let's get to unboxing. All right, so we have our box. Bubbles. Uh, look at that, it comes in a nice little box. So, here we have our Chemical Guys Detail Vac Portable Handheld Car Maintenance Vacuum Cleaner with accessories. Um, so, this came out a month or two ago, I think. Maybe just a little longer than that. It's 40 bucks. It's a pretty decent price. Um, this is my second vacuum from Chemical Guys. Um, I don't think the other one is made by them though. The one I bought. But I think they're just the distributor. Uh, so it's got a 110 watt bolt, uh, watt motor. Uh, lightweight and easy to use design. Complete kit with accessories. So uh, let's see. Before using the vacuum, unpack the product and review any uh, for any damaged and missing parts. Blah blah blah. Open the vacuum and confirm the HEPA filter is securely inserted. And that's about it. Alright. So. so I have our hose. A little nozzle. Small brush and then... I never did quite understand the point of these ones. Our heat of filter that we gotta make sure to put in. Yeah, I guess it comes with an extra one. Never mind. So there's our vacuum. It's nice, little, compact. I really like it. Uh, pretty long uh, cable, too. comes with its own little carrying bag I'll make sure to put it in here once I'm done so you can see how that looks like so uh, we're gonna try it out just with this alone and we'll throw on the attachments and see how clean we can get this car all right so one big factor uh, this vacuum is gonna be plugging into your 12 volt outlet or your cigarette lighter in the car. Doesn't have a normal cord. So keep that in mind before buying. Alright so this is the interior of Project Adam currently. I guess it is very messy. Um I'm gonna try to clean as much of this carpet as we can. I'm not gonna go into too much uh, interior detail and cleaning today. That's all from one uh, investigating the AC leak. So let's check her out. I find it kind of really weird how it fills up. I guess, I mean, it won't prevent anything, but I mean, there's really nothing. Nothing really stopping. I'm noticing 
mean right off the bat. The suction power is a little low. I feel like I gotta pass it over a couple times to get everything I want out. Um, especially in the carpet. I'm gonna empty it out real quick. We'll throw on some attachments and see how well those work. All right, so again, like I said, it, uh, the storage part is kind of weird. And then to pop it off, it's just this little. So, <laughs> really nothing to it. <laughs> Just hit this and it pops off. So, super simple. Alright, let's go throw this away. Alright, so this filter comes out. So it's a it's a really simple design. I like it, but I kind of at the same time wish it was a little more. Thing. But I guess that's why I have my other one. Um. All right, let's go check out the attachments. Let's go ahead and throw the attachments on. There's that. Um, it's all pretty simple. Um, all right, let's try it with this. Seems to get these little deep spaces. Right next to here. Yeah, uh, I really like this. to really concentrate on uh, one area. It's a little more tedious. Um, but it does seem... to be sucking more than what it was. Uh, there is one carpet tool I want to buy. 
<laughs> but it's like 200 bucks. But let's go finish up the other side and. Yeah, with the attachment, I think makes it a whole lot better. I think just without it, the... The suction power isn't as high. Alright, um... I do have some uh, Chemical Guys uh, Lightning Fast uh, Stain Extractor along with a carpet brush, carpet and upholstery brush um, that I want to review here in the future. Because uh, especially this car, uh, as you guys can see, <laughs> there is a whole lot of stains in here. Um, I really want to try cutting. Um, the rest of that carpet since it was already cut when I bought it. But let's go dump this out real quick and then give our final thoughts on this. Alright, so one thing um, gotta be careful with when pulling these out. It's not the best design. Uh, you probably could attach a clamp to these, make it look a little ratchet though. But make sure you're pulling out the whole piece instead of just that so that's one thing um i, I honestly I'm, I'm honestly surprised <laughs> with how um well it works i was expecting it to i, I was expecting more of a disappointment honestly I really like Chemical Guys, as you guys know, um, but I was um, expecting it to not work as well. Um, my biggest thing is this 12 volt uh, adapter. Um, they do milk uh, 12 volts to 120 volt, uh, 20, 20 volt uh, adapters, uh, so you can just plug it into an extension cord or something like that. Um, instead of having a, you know, use your car battery. Um, I'd say that's my biggest, uh, problem with this. Um, but apart from that, I, I really like it. Um, we're gonna empty this out. Um, so, I hadn't snapped this back in right. So, make sure when you do it, it snaps back in. Um, you'll clearly see it, otherwise you're going to have trouble. Uh, there you go, see, you'll hear it. Alright, so here we have the detail vac. I uh, wrapped the cord around the handle. Uh, just like that. Got to flip it this way. Um, managed to fit the tube and the uh, the crevice nozzle um, inside here so we managed to fit everything in there we have all our attachments and everything in there so that's really neat uh, the case is really cool Again, Kim Clyde's logo. Um, so I, I guess I get the point of this. Um, it's a vacuum that you can... Jesus, I don't know what the hell that was. Um, but it's a vacuum that you can pretty much carry with you at all times. So... If you're on the road, um, something. Uh, at a car show, especially. Uh, you don't have to look for an outlet, plug it into your car and start vacuuming. So, I mean, for that purpose, I think it's really cool. Again, you can always buy uh, 
a, an adapter to 120 volts and use it at your house with an extension or something like that. So, for 40 bucks, I think it's really where I walk it. All right, so like I said, um, for 40 bucks, I think it's a pretty good deal. Um, it cleaned up a whole lot better than I thought it would. Um, like I said, the attachments are a little flimsy. Um, but for 40 bucks, I mean, <laughs> what the heck? Um, I'm still waiting on my detailing cart from Chemical Guys, so if any of you guys are watching this from you guys, hey, get on it. <laughs> um, but apart from that, thank you. You guys are always coming out with really cool products. Um, I definitely say buy one. That's it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you guys did, subscribe if you guys aren't. Uh, we're still sitting at 310 subscribers really trying to get to a thousand this year but i'll settle with 500 if you guys do like the video as well smash that like button and then as always until next time i hope you guys are staying safe keep fucking going and i'll see you guys later